hitting C. And I think point, it's probably Gatsby. Just because of his ability, his speed to get out of the corner. I feel like if Gatsby makes it to winner's finals, there's a very good chance but that he makes it to Grant. Time, but yeah. before he does that, he has he to has get to him. Yeah, he has to but get I through like no if, if Assuming if one of those two players right here that we're watching right now were to play against C, I feel like Noku would have the better advantage only because PT really? kind of like, yeah, because oh, Paolo that's... doesn't really like fighting PT like that. But against the Falcon, Paolo, if, assuming you, you know the matchup, it's way easier fighting an aggressive Falcon that runs into you all the time rather than PT where you have to use your brain to play neutral <laughs> against Squirtle. You have to carefully edge guard Ivysaur because you don't really have that much resources besides your special moves. Charizard, well, you just show him who's the real top tier at that point. <laughs> but Squirtle is really the big key in that matchup. Just like right here, this is one of Falcon's worst matchups that Gatsby's going to manage to do. It. And I'm not sure if Gatsby fought Quid before, but I know he fought Noku. Oh, Gatsby has fought sure. Quid and Noku. So he has a great... He has, oh, I thought he was like Kuggy's diaper, Charizard. But we're going to get a juicy up smash read from Gatsby. He just read the <laughs> crap out of that roll. Oh, oh my, my God. God. And I like that Gatsby's not desperately immediately going for the crazy stomp. He's recently, when he gets that, he waits for the tech option first. And but, now and now he's just, now he's just letting him. Hold on a second. Did Falcon side B beat Squirtle side B? Is that what I saw? Yeah. That's um, just the thing. Because Raptor Bliss has armor in it. But so does Squirtle. Oh my god! <laughs> Did he just get up on footstool? <laughs> oh wait, no, you have to footstool Squirtle on the ground, I forgot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 But he was in the air. That makes sense. Alright. Try oh, to cheese him, but not, Gatsby not falling for the gimmicks right there. Yeah, I love that you have a high recovery, even if he's able to punish it. Like, if you go for the low recovery and it doesn't work out, you're dead. Yeah, you're dead. You're just but, dead. like, rather than if you're on 50%, you're not going to immediately die from up here unless you got bad DI. Oh, my God. I like to reverse up B. He said, nah, homie. I'm going around the hitbox. As a Falcon man, you really have to have amazing drift. And a lot of these horrible matchups that he has to go through. But now this is the... It's what I would say in a hard part, but already at stock ahead again. I, I love the use of that Falcon kick specifically to punish the run back. Yeah. Like run away, which is normally a really good option. You know, especially against Falcon, who like, you know, he's a lot of times he does like to go for things like neutral air or whatever. Yeah. So the fact that he runs back and that Falcon kick just covers all the distance it needs to. It's also it's also crazy because a Falcon kick has so many ways to kill. Rather it catches the landing and the first hitbox kills you. Oh my. He's been reading this man's move for a whole while right now. Yeah, Noku's movement has just been, it's, it's he completely knows exactly where he's gonna go. Gatsby is just looking so good right now, oh but off god. stage. Oh my god! No way. He let it rip <laughs> from across my man the was, planet. My man was playing Beyblade and let it rip with that knee right there, man. Shout out to Ivysaur's hurt box for extending that across the entire stage. He caught the little bud part too, I saw it. He caught the bud and was like, all right, you're dead. Um, what's your man in? All right, next game. GG, oh shake my hand. God. It's like that matchup is supposed to be really good for Pokemon Trainer. And you see, it's one of those funny things where it's like Gatsby looks so good, but also think about the way he was getting his stocks. Yeah. Like hard reads. He was he really was playing neutral. He was playing, he was playing neutral and he was really just cracking open that disadvantage state. He just took Turtle, the Squirtle, and made yeah. him into Squirtle. He thing. knows that Noku is, I feel like, because today was my first time playing him, and based off the knowledge that I got and what I'm witnessing right now, Noku seems to be one of those players that he's very good in the game, but if you pressure him just enough, he starts cracking really easily. And just like that, oh one, my one, God. Missed, one missed tech caused him the death. And now no, you ain't fighting me thing, with no, no, you ain't thing. fighting with Charles. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you ain't fighting me with Charles, homie. What are you doing? I don't know, man. Squirrel didn't work out too great just a minute ago. I did a level up. <laughs> we are my home territory too. I'm not being embarrassed by F Zero character. Why don't we go gun? to your F Zero stage? <laughs> Why don't we go to your F Zero game? Huh? They're not ready for that. <laughs> They're not ready for the F Zero vibes. Nice uh, B from Gatsby. That's really hard. To, Squirtle in general is a, a being that is hard to punish with his amazing frame data. The fact it's, that he's getting consistent Huggies diapers well, and Falcon kicks is really showing a lot. Oh my god. <laughs> it's like, I think it's using this, the Falcon special moves that have really generous hitboxes. Yeah. Squirtle can be so hard to hit. Oh man. I thought, yeah, he didn't have time for that knee right there. Yeah, like, Squirtle can be so hard to hit because of his small size. So he's using those Falcon specials that basically don't have to worry about how tiny they are. Right. Yo, my guy. We're looking at some height sets right now. And, and I, I like that Gatsby before me and you turn around. Oh, my God. Nice reactive up B right there. Stomp the yard. 
Nah, we're not gonna. Oh, nah, I love the empty land. I respect it. And he kills him like melee up here, bro. My man used up here like if it was melee's last life. All right, are we gonna get a three stock from Gatsby? Uh, atrocious I, roll, but gets away with it anyway. Yeah, this is something that can happen to Noku. Where yeah. I feel like if he's down by this much, like if Noku's about to get, if he's about to get three stocked, I feel like a lot <gasps> oh, of times. Oh, I love well, that. I love that attempt. Like he, he, Gatsby. I kind of think he expected the juicy down air from him, but Noku went for the smarter option and did the multi-hit drag down. Yeah, a lot of moments when Falcon does a husband's diaper and you have a. A, 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 what's the move? A long-lasting move or a rapid move, it trades with him, but Falcon goes down when you trade yeah. with it. So I like the attempt that he did with Nair. No jump from Gatsby. Gets the air dodge. All right. Ooh. He, I, I love it. He read it, but did it way too early. This is, I was just no going to say, this is no, this is still anybody's game. And this is why this matchup is very annoying for Falcon. But not when you get a janky down smash read, just like, oh, oh. That's like the seventh row read that he's gotten, though. And Gatsby's and just been chilling. Yeah, that's a He hasn't idea. even been really. He, it's the fact that Gatsby wasn't even really, like, forcing too much pressure on the ledge. His presence alone made him shook to the point where you're coming to me, and I know you're going to come.